welcome back i just got home from revivals cvs right aid and the dollar tree because i want to decorate my apartment so let me show you what i got okay so i understand this is an awful angle but oh well see hi kitten hi hi <laughs> oh your little arms i want to do that thing where it's like boom 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 Bum, bum, bum. <laughs> she won't let me do it. Oh my god, there it is! <laughs> we'll start at the Dollar Tree first. So since I have a front door and people walk past often, these are not for you. I decided to be like, get little festive things to put up like I did with my Christmas thing. So I got this heart. Oh, this heart for Valentine's Day. And then I got a shamrock for St. Patrick's Day. It's not for you. And then I got three little pieces of like small decor items that were really cute. And I'm, knock it off, Mora. It's not for you. And I'm really surprised that they were from the Dollar Tree because of how cute they actually are. So the first thing I found the second I even walked into the store was this cute little tray. And it says stay sassy and it's got like this gold trim around it and then i found randomly they had this in white too and i was like oh i could put it in like the living room but it'll be really cute in here because i'm trying to like go for like a neutral boho type of thing i know it's not really working right now but like i'm not done so just like give me a minute not even started pretty much i rearranged my i rearranged my room if you haven't noticed just yesterday i didn't film it because it was like a spur of the moment type of thing but i found this really cute um gold feather and it's just like a little tray so i don't know what i'll do with it but it was a dollar and it's gold and adorable for the dollar tree and then i just had to get this i don't know if this is a llama or an alpaca, but this is gonna go in my living room. And he is just so cute. Again, only a dollar. Which normally like little like figurines like this would be like five, 10 bucks. And I'm like, a dollar. Literally, I love the Dollar Tree and it is so underrated. I mean, look at these really new cute things that I just got that were normally at least always over five dollars if you go anywhere else a dollar I mean, that's gonna be so cute in here I got muddy buddies because um, they're really good mm -hmm. now there's this store called revivals and it's like a Palm Springs thing I don't know if it's anywhere else but they have it's like um it's kind of like a goodwill but like different like they have pieces there that they actually like sell and they have like multiples of but then they also have pieces that are like donated from other people and they have the cutest furniture by the way they have the, the side table that i want for my living room but it's 140 dollars and it matches my coffee table so um i want that just not for that price and i can't find it literally anywhere else for any cheaper so whatever i went to um revivals and i got this silver frame i think i'm gonna put it up on one of my shelves that i just put up in my living room two bucks it's like a really cute silver frame i have to print out a picture for it but it was two dollars they didn't have, have a whole lot of like a selection this is gonna go in my room because i don't have anything like these in here i got a candle and it's a spiced cranberry oh my god it smells so good it smells like fall but fall's like my favorite scent time year everything of everything about fall is literally my favorite isn't the right color but i like the way it smelled so it's gonna come in here i just want to change the tone of my room to not be like gray and purple and then literally everything else because i want it to be more like neutral tones like how i have or like jewel tones kind of how i have in my living room where i have you know the gray but then i have like a cream and that like 
burnt orange and dark like emerald green like that's what I want in here to start on this wonderful journey of redoing my room in different colors I have had this and I hate pink never liked pink ever so I don't know why I got pink because I was an idiot but I have had this literally forever and it holds all my pencils and it sits on my desk and it doesn't look cute so I got this one dollar at revivals and it's just like this ribbed white cup I mean it looks like it could be something that you would put like your toothbrushes in or something it was in the cup section they had two of them so I was just like this is white it's perfect it's gonna go on my desk and look so cute and it'll look a whole lot better than this it's gonna look so cute this was only a dollar so and oh and this candle was five bucks it was 4.95 and they have like a bunch of different ones and then they have like another section where it's not like this brand but it's they have literally everything and then i went to cvs on i got these push pins because so on this wall on this wall i want to put i want to go to target and i want to get the shelves that i have in my living room and put them here and i want to get some ivy like long plants i don't know where in the world people get them but i want them because i want to put some on that wall and then some like up here as well i just want it to be like planty i want that style i for some odd reason am loving that style more i on the wall above my i'm devastated about this wall because i cannot put anything on it for the life of me because this wall connects to my neighbor's wall and that means that this wall is a firewall meaning there is a thick plat metal sheeted wall thing in between the wall and so there's like a little bit of drywall and then a metal wall and then my neighbor's wall so that means that i can't put anything on that wall because nails won't go into it so i was like well i can't hang anything on the wall so i'm just going to tape things to the wall but then again i remembered that i have stupid walls as in i have textured walls meaning that nothing sticks to it command strips don't stick to it tape doesn't stick to it because it's not a smooth flat surface so i'm going i found these palm springs life magazines and they have so many cute things in them and they were only a dollar each which normally they're five bucks they're normally five dollars six bucks five bucks so over ten over fifteen dollars right here i got for three dollars and i'm just i found i actually looked through them and found some really cute photos that i'm gonna rip out and hang up on the wall with the thumbtacks so um my camera is gonna die but i'm going to put some stuff away try decorating a little bit and i will update you later okay so for the past however long it's been i haven't done anything but watch tiktok videos and if you want to follow me on TikTok, because I do make videos that are actually pretty funny if you ask me and everybody who watches them, then this is my username and feel free to follow me. So I tested it and the tacks do go in the wall. So I'm very excited about that. Oh my God, I'm so excited. This is gonna look so cute. <laughs> this one's like my favorite. I think it's really, really cute. Oh, I love this. It's like getting like rough around the edges, so I'm probably just gonna take like an X-Acto knife and just like cut up the side of it. Oh my God, I loved these. I loved, okay, so I really like this one, but then I also love this one. So, this one's really nice too, but like, oh, I can't decide. I'm obviously gonna rip it out and see which one I like. So, I have all of my photos, and 
my thumbtacks. I have no idea how I'm gonna do this. I just want it to look like, like a collage. I don't know how to do this. I, I, mm, oh. I feel like if I just kind of like start randomly putting them up, it'll eventually just like come together. I feel like, oops. Is this like not the cutest thing ever? Oh my gosh, I love it so much! Okay, so this is what I've come up with. This is like the whole thing. It's very small, but I think it's just like a cute, it's just like a cute little like collage on the wall just to like put something on the wall, make it, you know, more full. And it very much fits the vibe that I'm going for. I think this is just about done. Besides this little skull that I always put up here, I don't really, I got them around Halloween. It's supposed to be like blackish gray, but I don't really have anything else to put up here. So I think that this is done. Um, I just have to clean off my desk and like up there and put my stuff away from my bed go through everything and take that down and put up the new shelves after I go and get them. But yeah, I love the way that it turned out. Okay, well, that's all for the video, I guess. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe if you aren't already because I am posting videos every single Friday at 1 p.m. If I can make it to 1 p.m., I'm doing my best so far, so just make sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.